you know, those little guys just chilling in, my, in the passenger seat of my car in the driveway. Can't be driving it right now. I just took two shots of liquor, so. You know, unfortunately, I got this, so I can't fucking drive. So I'm just sitting in the passenger seat. I mean, I shouldn't be driving anyway, honestly, but I, I definitely can't drive because I have that thing. You know, so look at that. Give me this at the dispenser. It's like they're coming out with these things, these snooze bites by Select. It's a combination of THC and CBN in a bite. I'll show you guys what I call it. Take a couple of one of them, but then my fucking vape battery died. So what we got is green caffeine, select elite full grain. That's what I read. That's what I ripped already. That's what I'm stoned on. Then I got a half gram select elite live resin cheddar melt and a full gram regular elite dosi cake. Yeah, honestly, I've been sticking with the with the concentrates recent more recently. Sometimes, like, because they get me they get me more high. You know, I have a really fucking high tolerance to weed. It takes a lot of fucking flour to get me high. Even takes a lot of this to get me high. I have to take like fucking ten hits before I'm like fucking blasted. I'm blasted now. I also took two shots of liquor also. But uh. Yeah, I got, I got some, I got some nice shit from this. The uh, green caffeine is pretty good. I think it's just green crack, but they call it green caffeine. You know? Oh, I think I said in another video, some nine-year-old guy was like, imagine like a nine-year-old guy that's like, Are you trying to sell me crack, bro? Like what? Yeah, I want to take my pen off the charger and take one more. Break, bro. Let's go do it. Let's go do it. Let's go do it. Yes, I try to blow into the bread line to see what I've blown off this plant. I didn't know if I'm blowing into this thing just to see what I fucking blow. And then getting it set up right over my fucking TPO, bro. Shit, I'm in the charger. Yeah, I bought this hat where I do community service. 
It's like an animal rehabilitation center in the, where I live. It's like right up the road from my house up here. My fucking farm. I live in this dude. I live in the basement of this dude's house. The only private space I really have is that area downstairs, like, and then the kitchen is shared. He has a fucking dog. That I literally can't fucking bring anybody into the fucking house because the dog attacks everybody. I'm afraid of his dog. Even though his dog won't attack me, like I'm afraid of his dog. His dog is fucking crazy. His dog is fucking crazy. He's bitten me a couple of times. This is the person I know. Like I'm renting out this basement from Somebody I know. He's giving me a good price on it. Like him and his fiance live here. This is his house and he runs out the basement to me. So I try to keep shit cool, you know. I don't, I don't, know. Like, I don't like to cause problems here, so. I don't really invite people over and shit. Like I usually go out if I'm going to hang out with anybody. Okay, this is pretty much a place to lay my head at night. You can hear this fucking dog barking now. Right now he thinks I'm somebody else. He's right there in the fucking window. I see his fucking face. That fucking retard. I hate that fucking dog, bro. I don't hate dogs. I hate that dog. Peace out, guys. If you're struggling, don't give up. Don't ever give up. There's always hope. Peace.